Jocata was married to a man, John Duke of Bedford, who was a scholar at the time, and one of his great interests was alchemy. The reason for this was twofold. One is that for many people it was a spiritual path that would lead to enlightenment. It was the only science of the day. It was where people were working, almost as if you chose to be a physicist today. And the other reason was that people believed that they might discover the, the secret that would turn dull, ordinary matter into gold. John Duke of Bedford was regent. He was trying to hold down France. He had an immensely expensive army. If he could find the secret of turning lead into gold, he would win the war in France. The science of alchemy was an ancient one, but it really dominated the medieval world. It was really the only science there was. It came into Europe as part of the Renaissance when people started translating the Arabic documents, and the Arabs had in their turn translated the Greek and the ancient Latin documents. It built up to a belief in the nature of the world, which was that it was in the process of creation, and that perhaps alchemists might find a way to bring it to fruition quicker, both by using heat, applying water by using scientific processes, but also by meditation. It was a spiritual exercise as well.